And now we have Doug Semenik down below. The skipper joins us on the post-game show. The final is 9-5 with Gary winning the game tonight. Doug, thanks for taking the time. And it seemed like this game got away very early from Drew Bolin when Gary scored those four runs in the fourth inning. And that seemed to set an ugly tone, huh? Uh, he didn't have it tonight. He was releasing the ball all over the place. It was a little wild. and He lost his cool a couple times. So, you know, we need to get a better start game so we can – at least stay in it, and if we don't get that, then it makes for a long night. Doug, how about Justin Erasmus and then Curtis Camilli coming in? Erasmus giving you five innings to try to save that bullpen. I thought he pitched well tonight. Yeah, he's been doing that job very good for us. I mean, we've been using it a lot, so, you know, we got to hope we're going to shut him down for a couple of days now, but he's done a good job, yeah, in, the, in that situation. And offensively, I know it came too little and too late, but you got home runs from Sawyer Carroll and Petey Paramore. Do you see some things that maybe encourage you moving forward in this series? Well, I mean, you know, you got you to gotta be able to counter if something bad happens to you, and we haven't been able to do that. We haven't been able to get a lead. That's been an issue, and I don't know. I just, I, I've had team meetings. I can't have any more of those. I mean, it's just been one thing after another, so... You know, just going to have to try to fight our way out of here these two games and get on the road and try to do something. So just been a little bit, um, you know, just perplexing. It's been a little demoralizing, humbling. I don't know, call it what you want to call it, but it just hasn't been quite what we had. We played 35 games. I know we did that, and we did pretty well. And then mm -hmm. the last 15, 18 games has been just a nightmare. And you have Taylor Stanton going tomorrow evening, and that has to be a real plus as he's been pitching a lot better of late. Yeah, he has, and hopefully he can pitch a good game. He pitched a good game last time out over in St. Paul, and hopefully he can do some of the things that he did his last two starts and, you know, get us over the hump here. Doug, thanks for the visit. Good luck thanks. tomorrow night. Doug Semenek with us on our postgame show. The Red Hawks losing by a final of 9-5. to five. It is, I think Doug has put it very, very well. It's, it's demoralizing. They've had team meetings. It is just a matter of plugging away and seeing if you can kind of get that ship right. It's